Boom! What's up everyone? Mark Lobon here, TigerFitness.com! Cardio. Anyway, it's Sunday morning. I woke up a little early. My daughter has a doubleheader soccer game. She's playing with the U9s and the U10s today. Back-to-back -back games, so I decided to get up, finish it off. 15 minutes of cardio, just get blood going, get metabolism rocking, stay in good health and all that shit. Have a... Uh, what happened here? I have Clash, some machine fuel, rocking and rolling. Um, be a good day, man. The weekend, Sunday, it's gonna go to Ohio tomorrow, but the snowstorm's coming in, so I postponed my trip till Thursday. So here goes, man. I'm gonna get all my calories in. You're gonna see that. And um, we're gonna rock and roll. Let's rock this. <sighs> Forgot to mention, I've been working here for uh, an hour or so. Uh, and there's no days off when you own a business, man. You gotta work every single day. Because the world goes on, man. You don't get to just take days off, go on cruises, miss stuff. I'll save that for when I sell this thing. And that's years and years away. Heads up, I got a lot of liquid left in my drink. So I'm going to throw some of these greens in here. This is one supplement. This is my favorite supplement we make. Other than the yummy proteins, man. The greens and malty is the best product on the market for what it does. Period. Boom. Forgot to record my breakfast. My breakfast was 50 grams of protein from egg whites and 60 grams of carbs from grits. I forgot to do that. I should probably unpack. I'm leaving Thursday, so screw it. Anyway, I'm gonna show you some meal prep um, for the day. Cammy's got like four hours of games, so I'm gonna go take care of that. Look at that fade, man. My local sports clips in Elgin, I know he's sports clips, but man, I spent like 60, 70 bucks on haircuts. And I'll tell you what, this is as clean of fade as you can get. This is almost ghetto quality fade right here. So um, let's go see my food. Thomas, dude. Show the abs. Abs. That, those aren't abs. Okay, those are abs for today. Where's your hey, abs? Okay, do you want to hold this? All right, so food prep. Okay, so I got eight ounces of chicken in here. Now, what I'm going to do is I need 60 grams of carbs. I can't see. We have too many protein involved. It's A, but that's the best protein on earth. I'm going to guesstimate this. So I need a little bit of, you put a little bit of the barbecue sauce on the first layer, right? Now, the rule of thumb for brown rice is about 50 grams of carbs per cup. I'm not anal retentive and my I'm probably not going to train today at all. Then you put the cup of rice, so there's your 50 grams of carbs, right? And then, here's the, here's the kicker guy, put your second layer of Sweet Baby Ray's. Now, a lot of you are wondering, why not use Casey Masterpiece like Ronnie? Because Sweet Baby Ray's owns Casey Masterpiece, much better. Now, especially the honey one. Yeah, it's got to be the honey barbecue. Think about Ronnie. Ronnie's actually open mind. He said he went to Costco and he got some Sweet Baby Ray's. He didn't like it. He had to throw it away. Sweet Baby Ray's is sweeter. Sweet Casey Baby Ray's Masterpiece has more of a kick. What was rated the number one store-bought barbecue sauce? Sweet Baby Ray's. Now, I've been having issues with digestion because my calories, as you'll see today, I've already had my egg whites and, and grits are higher. So I'm getting all my veggies, I kid you not, except when Katie makes dinner with broccoli incorporated in it. My machine greens and multi. I already talked about this this morning. Um, what, what I have Katie do as well. Barracuda is very good for women, um, especially if you want to make them horny. So um, it's better than spiking Viagra and Cialis in her stuff like I used to do. So I put Barracuda <laughs> with the greens and it kind of it tastes all right, doesn't it? I think it's good. She thinks it's good. I like it. Whatever. So that's that. These are my to-go meals. Um, my way, I've been drinking. I was having about five of my eight meals being whey protein. And I just want to chew my food. I still think, now here's the deal. I'm going to do an individual video on this, but uh, a guy who's a, again, I have no beef with Rich Piana. He actually argued with me that whey protein is a scam. It doesn't work. And it doesn't work as protein. I never said whey protein was, you know, better than food. I will say it has a higher biological value. I'll also say to say that whey protein, that whey protein doesn't work. That's like saying that chicken doesn't work. But he argued that unless it's from whole food, which it is from Whole Food. I, I, again, it was a weird conversation. I probably shouldn't have gotten all worked up, but I respect the guy for calling me. He's not just a nameless, faceless troll. He gave me his phone number and I called him out on it. But uh, at the end, I'll do a separate video on that. Anyway, these are my to-go meals for the soccer game. I'll see y'all later. Boom. Yo, on our way to soccer. Cammy, you ready? Yeah. What are you going to do today? Dominate. Ha <laughs> ha. This is good, man. This is their first game this winter season. They're playing Elmhurst. Do you like them? No, they're... They're what? <laughs> no, don't answer that. Okay, so, um...
Cammy for her intro. Let's see. We, you know, we pay attention to. I mean, she's at the end of the day. They might be kids, but they still have um, nutritional needs um, to perform, and also, you know, just for health and function. And uh, she's going to burn a lot of calories. She has a double header today because she's playing on two teams, the U9 and the U10. So, you know, for breakfast, she had about, you know, 12, 15, 20 grams of protein. Um, she has some milk with some vanilla MTS in it. And she also had a piece of yummy apple strudel. What is it? Cinnamon strudel uh, bread? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was about, you know, 25 grams of carbs. She had about 30 grams of carbs from a uh, apple um, apple cake bar from Trader Joe's. Cereal bar. Cereal bar. And then intra, I give her some uh, machine fuel with, you know, a scoop of machine fuel with um, 25 grams of carbolic. And then she has another drink if she needs it that she'll sip as soon as the game's done or if she finishes the other one of the same, which is a scoop of machine fuel and 25 grams of carbolic. So a lot of people like supplements for kids. Well, they're looking at branch chains and carbohydrate. I mean, it's nothing crazy. It's nothing out of the ordinary. Would you rather them get carbohydrate from French fries at McDonald's or carbohydrate from a, a good old fashioned, not old fashioned, a good high end carb powder like carbolic or even dextrose? I would rather see that. So her recovery would be on point. And again, I wish this was something I had as a kid. You know, just imagine if you were a kid and you had these um, nutritional strategies available to you that work for athletes. I know we always talk about, you know, bodybuilders not needing carbs intra and all this and all the science and, and that's fine, but you gotta realize that the, the studies done on athletes and recovery, they're there. Anyway, guys, um, off to the game. Cammy, I'm proud of you, baby. And it was a Picture. No, it ain't a picture, but you can you can smile like we're doing a swelfy. You played very well. You played extremely well. Very proud of you. Two games. What do we need to work on? We need to work on your endurance. Dude, your moves were sick. They were fire. They were fire. Fire! Fire! What? <laughs> Alright, so we're on our way home. That's it. Good job, girl. Alright, Thomas, do you want to watch? Look at him. He's a Aaron Rodgers fan. I gotta tell you, getting rid of Brett Favre, I'm a big Brett Favre fan, or just letting him kinda wean his way out. I love Brett Favre, but uh, man, he overstayed his welcome. It's kinda like me coming out of bodybuilding retirement every year, huh, Katie? I'm the, I'm the, I'm the mediocre bodybuilding equivalent of Brett Favre. Anyway, I'm gonna do some stuff around the hizzle around here. Um, I'm gonna fix that. There's a couple links. All right, so I'm gonna fix that up there. And uh, 202 is the game. All right. Uh, oh, there it is. Cowboys Packers. I'm going to get my office cleaned up. I'll show you before and after. I might train arms day. My body's pretty tired, and I'm going to break up the driveway a little. I might just, I haven't had an off day since last Saturday, Katie. So I might actually do that. Cammy, we got some kettlebells too, so we'll just do that. Packers win. All right, we'll see. They're playing. I don't know, guys. What do you think? It's gonna be. This is gonna be aired afterwards. I'm gonna get my prediction now. Green Bay's up seven. It's not really fair. Um, Green Bay, win. Green Bay, thirty-five, Dallas, thirty-one. So this is my office. This is gonna be tight. We're gonna have a TV right here. My desk. I think we're gonna move that. But basically, my goal today is to clean out this crap, and that way we can get an area rug in here, so you won't have echo when I film. Put this TV up. Um, I think we're putting my desk. We'll put a couch over here. Um, I don't know if we're going to use that. That was free. Um, and then you go back here. Some more storage. Got a wet bar, a little sink area. Um, so we're going to clean this out today. Lunch time. I saved one. I ate one of my meals. So I saved this as eight ounces of mango salsa. Oh, look at that service. Eight ounces of chicken about 50 grams of carbs from the rice, about 10 grams of carbs from all that mango salsa. What's that? Kale salad with chicken. Oh, that's brilliant. What'd you eat, Cammy? I ate, um... What daddy had with... with chicken. What you had without the salsa. Yeah. Awesome. And the uh, Dallas is up 14 to 7. So I'm gonna get some work done, and then I'm gonna go to finishing the office. All right, guys. So we're about to hit a snowstorm tonight. Actually, I'm supposed to go to Ohio today. But I canceled it. I'm going to go on Thursday instead. It's 30 degrees out, which is honestly comfortable after the S we've been through. Anyway, what I'm going to do now is my brims are already pretty far back. I'm going to make sure the bottom's nice and cut up, you know? Make sure there's no ice there or snow. Um, because it's been 30, it's melted a lot. You see, 
A lot of reasons for black driveways is the fact that, well, the sun melts it. So we're pretty good here. Thomas is just gonna get the walkway and stuff. And this is what men do in the Midwest, right? And it's what idiots do who move out of California. So I just did some uh, office work and I fixed my office. Now I'm gonna I put some salt on. So hopefully I can break up that bottom a little more. Like a boss, no jacket, no nothing. It's looking good. All right, here's my pre-dinner meal. Ah, look at that. Sludge is not complete without fat-free whipped cream. That definitely fits my mind. There's like barely anything in these. And then two slices of Zico bread, about 50, half yeah, 50 protein, and about 50 to 60 carbs on point. So check it out. I'm getting some work done. Ring at the doorbell. Cammy was texting a friend. She came over, so I guess we have company for dinner. It's a good thing, because kids love organic beef burgers and organic french fries, because we're all about organic. This is one of her soccer teammates, so I'm shanking to be on here. Put kids on this channel, they didn't sign the waiver. Anyway, man, you think Denver, Indianapolis, I'm still, I'm a big Manning fan. I have to watch this. Preston, how many granola bars do you have, bro? Coach defense. Ah. Uh, Oh, I'll show the after of my office when I go down there to do something. No, never too cold to grill. <laughs> and I like to keep my summer clothes on when I grill too. So anyway, we got some organic beef, pretty lean burgers going on here. Katie makes them really nice. She, anyway, you gotta flatten them out a little bit there. Get that grill mark. So anyway, <laughs> the secret to gains when you're in really cold weather, Hurry up. <laughs> forces your body to warm itself. When it warms itself, it talks too much. It increases your metabolic rate, which means that you are going to make gains. Now, I'm, I'm getting done. wet. Come on. <laughs> I usually have that effect on females. But I'm bump. Hold on, hold on. I, I didn't put my jacket on. And I'm yeah, getting that's wet. That's your dumbass fault. I'm fine. You're old natty. I'm not natty. I don't get cold. All right, here we go. All right, that's excellent. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm almost done. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you gotta flatten them out. So anyway, these are five ounce patties. They'll cook down to about three and a half. And um, that's it. It's time to make some game. Let's try this again. My phone keeps messing up. Okay, 50 protein, 60 carbs. Gains, 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 gains. Delicious gains. Sweet potato fries, regular See fry. that? That's snow and sweat. Shirt's drenched. I'm pumped though, man. Ah. Uh, Anyway, check it out. You'll see at the end of this video, do not turn this off. The human snow plow. It's a move I, I freaking pioneered. Two snow shovels, one man, and a whole lot of force. Mass times acceleration equals force. The machine's all about that. That was my hit cardio for the day. 30 straight minutes of sprinting in snow. Midwest. How do people get fat out here? Thomas. It's time to go get my baby's bath. The 20 year old Swedish blondes I have sitting in my bathtub. All right, so you walk down my stairs, you go to the left. Okay, you got the guest house. Okay, bedroom back there. For people who stay over, a lot of them are business associates. So we have a nice little workstation um, complete with USB ports and everything. Then you go through here, this is the room. Last person to stay here was my man Steve Shaw and his lovely family. So we always welcome whoever's here. And of course, you got sleeping quarters. There's the beds and closets, full room. Cool little bathroom right there, you know, full bathroom. This is my pride and joy, man. Look at that entertainment center, built in speakers, you know, really nice. <clears throat> Put our Christmas tree away. A little kitchenette going on here. Again, we're still, uh, because we have some stuff there because we were cleaning my office. Now, the reconfiguration is going to be over here. There's going to be a couch, full-size couch. And here's my, my work area. All right. So, oh, back there, we're going to have, that's what, my, that's what you're going to see on camera on YouTube. So we're going to have a M and it's not a game behind my chair. And I'm going to buy a new chair. That chair is old. I need something better on my back. And that's the one to make games during the day. And we have an armoire and a refrigerator back there, so. And this is where my TV is gonna go. So this should be tight. Anyway, uh, that's what I've done today. And with this final meal, I bid you farewell. I had a couple pieces of beef jerky, the Costco kind that you've seen in my other vlogs. 
because I sweat so much. You just stay tuned. I'm going to put those videos at the end. Of, yeah, I did over, I did almost 12,000 steps today. That's a lot. Um, between running up and down the driveway, probably 40 or 50 times sprinting down the driveway, chasing Preston throughout soccer and just my normal day moving stuff. Um, I'm glad I took the day off the gym. I, I wouldn't have had time to do half the stuff I do anyway. Cookies and cream, two scoops of MTS, about 20 grams of carbs from blueberries, a little bit of that fat free whipped cream. About 35 grams of carbs from that there raisin Ezekiel bread. Some coffee with a little bit of Splenda in it. A little, what is it? What flavor is that? Whatever, friend, vanilla something, you know. Um, and that's it. So that's my day. That's a Sunday. I can't say it's a normal Sunday, but it's not. A, what is a normal Sunday? There is no such thing. But I also, what you didn't see is I got about five to six hours of office work done um, in between all this stuff. So... This is the day. So it is a uh, 9:42 now, and uh, you guys, it might be up now. I'm gonna be up intermittently throughout the night because we're launching our content site and we need to test it. But um, you guys are gonna see an all new, best in class of any website in the sport nutrition industry site coming at you. Best info, best authors. Just wait, just wait. I'm gonna link it down below if it's ready, or you'll already know about it because everybody's gonna be talking about it. We're here to help you reach your goals, and I'm here because you're not just a number to me. But I'm tired, I'm hungry, and MTS Nutrition Cookies and Cream. Oh, one thing I didn't show you is the supplements I take um, because everybody always complains about that, but eh, it's my channel. I always take NR, uh, Before Bed, Resurrect PM, Machine Greens I showed you this morning. I love Barracuda. Of course, Machine Fuel. Clash pre-training. I took it took it today in the morning with cardio. Um, that's just some of the stuff, and of course that there MTS Nutrition Way. So there's your brief supplement mention, and of course, put all your supplements in your Tiger Fitness or MTS Shaker Cup, because here we sell shit and selling shit. That's not a game. <laughs> the human snowplow. When are we going to do each other's hair? <laughs> no, seriously, who has the brush and the, the little rubber band things? And the berets. This is my hair. Berets? I usually... Berets? Yeah. Berets. Berets? Berets? Isn't it French? Isn't it beret? So I guess that's a no. Does this look good on me, though? <laughs> no. Okay. Okay, I, 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 my feelings are hurt. Do I look better now? No! <laughs> no? 